Welcome to Mikon's hardware. I'm not home at the moment, so I do not have access to all my standard equipment. Still, before going away, I have finished testing Team UEX 99M Pro D3 motherboard. In this video, I'm going to tell you everything you need to know about the motherboard. Unfortunately, I cannot recommend the motherboard because the board I have has only two memory channels. Yes, I know that many people online report that this motherboard has full four memory channels, but in my case the motherboard has four memory slots and only two memory channels. It's really pity because overall the motherboard is not that bad. The VRM is slightly better than Machinist X99 RS9 or Machinist X99 G7. We still have exactly the same components, but in this case we have all four phases in use. So we have four phases, each phase has a doubler and it results into eight phases. Some will say that these are eight fake phases, but it is what it is. From the positives, I can say that Team UA X99 M Pro D3 works with Huana G X99 QD4 bias. It means that Turbo Boost Unlock can be implemented with the Mi 899 application, you can also get access to run timings and enable resizable bar or rebar. I can also say that both of the PCI Express X1 slots are working. On Machinist X99 G7, one of the slots is defective. All in all, it's a very standard cheap Chinese MATX X99 motherboard with all the standard defects and features. Sleep mode doesn't work and DDR3-2133 speed I was not able to test. At the moment I do not have a single DDR3 stick that would work at this speed, so the maximum I was able to test is DDR3-1866. And for the conclusion, I don't really have much more to say. My score for the motherboard would be 5 out of 10, and I do not recommend buying it. If you really need a cheap X99 motherboard with a DDR3 memory compatibility, then I would go with Huanan G X99 QD3. QD3 has 4 memory channels, and the quality is slightly better overall. With this, I have to say thanks for watching, thanks for listening, bye for now.